kids, you you stop playing your Fortnites and your calls of duties and uh, <laughs> your Unreal tournaments and your Quake Three multiplayer because Pong is back, Amanda. Amanda Pong nice. is back. How exciting is that? It's, I'm I'm pumped. It's not very exciting. It's, it's yeah, I'm uh, not very pumped. There's actually this music is fucking amazing though. I like the way they put the little beep boop pong in there. So uh, welcome back to the dojo, everybody. I'm Jeff. I'm Amanda. Uh, and we're playing Pong Quest, which inexplicably is the best thing that's come out today on Tuesday. Um, they saved all the games for Friday, Amanda. Every game comes out on Friday. There's like eight games on Friday, uh, and there's like yeah. nothing today. So, <sighs> so we're gonna play Pong Quest and see what happens. We'll make Pong Quest work. I it's think it's so. fine. It's Pong, but an RPG. How could what? <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> Two uh, great tastes that taste great together. Before I hit the A button to play, so we can stretch this out even longer, Amanda. What are your? Uh, are you pro pong or are you a, 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 a pro pong or an anti pong? Are you? Who's anti pong? I am. It's boring. It's dull. He's like, that's a red flag. If a girl came up to me and said she wanted a date, and I was like, all right, but I got to know how you feel about Pong. Uh -huh. And she goes, I love Pong. And then it's like, well, we're not going out then. It's like, get out of here, Sydney. You? you pay for your own dinner. <laughs> what kind of dumb, what is this? It's table tennis, but you got to do it. You do it on a computer. That's just, that's just dumb. Uh-oh. Marcus. Oh, wow. What is, oh, he's so angry. Wait, which one? Yeah, of, he's real pissed. Which one is Marcus. Is this Marcus the one on the right or the one on the left? Well, that's uh, a question. Uh, oh, okay. Oh. oh, okay. Hey, thanks, game. All right. Why do I have a health <laughs> bar? This is Pong. Uh, all right, move. <laughs> oh, man. This is your opponent. Oh, my opponent. Oh, okay. It's Marcus. It's, yeah, okay. Yeah, eat it, Marcus. Here comes the Pong ball. This is the ball. Hit the ball past your Pong. I don't oh believe that God. they're tutorializing Pong here, Amanda. Wait, every How time... How much more... Oh, Jesus. Every time it hits me, I lose a health point. Oh, boy. So I got to use left bumper and right bumper to switch between balls. You guys choose which ball you want to use. All right. Which... Uh, how do I go yeah, to you a You got to get fancy with your ball work. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, damn. Hit the bubble to obtain a new type of ball. Ah! Ooh. <laughs> The problem with Pong... Uh, Everyone's going to find out how bad at Pong you are. <laughs> I, You know, the, the reason that I'm so bad at Pong is because it's so fucking boring that my brain just refuses to, to <laughs> consider Pong. It's like, Pong, what? <laughs> what I, got, I got a life. I could be playing anything. I could be playing, like, Checkers or, you know, uh, Hangman or... Uh, uh, what are some other games? That one with, like, the, the triangle with a bunch of little... Uh, like uh, little pegs in it, and then you like jump over the pegs and you try to get the oh, last yeah. one. Uh, or like Wooly Willy, you could be playing Wooly Willy right now. How do I? How do I use the ball? Is oh. Marcus crying? Oh, curveball, Marcus! Yeah, Marcus is almost dead. Whoa, there it comes, Mark. Oh, Marcus, he's too good at pong. I'm gonna yeah, lose he's this. He's a pro. Yeah. Yeah. Eat it, Eat it. Marcus. <laughs> oh, it's the king of pong. It's King Pong. <laughs> <laughs> what is this bullshit fucking <laughs> this story mode for Pong? This oh. is already the most amazing game we've played in a while, Jeff. <laughs> we've got a new rising star on our hands. Am I right, sir? Pong's a lot. Wait, <laughs> is that sir Pong's a lot on the right with the boobs? He's got big square yes. Pong boobs, right? He does. I see it. Okay. Sir Pong's a lot. My name is Derek, your highness. <laughs> Whatever, says King <laughs> Pong. Okay, you there, the fresh young paddle who won that battle. I've got a task for you. You know, oh, I've been, um, I've been, I've been watching inexplicably. I've been watching a lot of Homestar Runner on YouTube, and I mm -hmm. can't help but hear King Pong as the King of Town's voice from Homestar <laughs> Runner. <laughs> yes, it's a brilliant task. I can't even do it very well. A wonderful, nope. exciting, and incredibly dangerous adventure. What's wrong with Derek? He's so sad. The king doesn't know his name, I guess. Yeah. First, you need to see if you're as good as I think you are. Nobody so. wants to uh, acknowledge his uh, pong boobs. That's right. Yes, your highness. Take this young paddle to the training dungeon. Uh, I, I'm sorry. I man, I actually thought we were playing a wholesome pong game, but it appears I'm going to have to bust out the Jeff's head censorship for the training just, dungeon. I'm just glad that this pong game didn't turn into one of your weird sex ninja games. <laughs> 
There actually was a game that came out that I forgot until right this moment. <laughs> uh, that was about like uh, it was an old people dating simulator. It was like a nursing home dating simulator called Later nice. Daters. Um, which uh, what color pong should we be? Aubergine, oh. sea salt, dandelion. If, if you make him flesh tone, he'll look like a peen. I'm just throwing it out there. Is that blossom? All right. <laughs> Maybe he's got like a hat. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Medium hair. <laughs> Where's medium hair pink? Medium hair. Oh, it's not pink. Uh, wait. Oh, that's we're getting closer. We're getting closer. <laughs> wait, hold on. What if it was a what if it was a dong that was wearing a sombrero? I love it. Uh, okay. All right. And then uh, with a little porn stash. Yeah. Or red of nose. <laughs> some gold earrings. <laughs> some freckles. A backpack. <laughs> well, I only see one thing now, so it doesn't matter what you choose. <laughs> has uh, ha has the internet provided us with a game that's just Pong on Steam, except that it's just dongs instead of Pong, and it's called Dong, and you just have two uh, two dongs that you go up back and forth, and then you hit like a testicle between each other. <laughs> Jesus, like, that's a thing, right? I mean, that's I feel like, like general jousting should have that as like a. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I put a little purple dress. <laughs> uh, summer dress. Ooh, muy caliente. College <laughs> sweater. Oh, did he go to Pong College? Okay. Formal suit. Business Pong. Oh, Mario. Luigi. So you can just straight up make this uh this dong into Mario. All right, I'm uh, I'm gonna go with uh with Nakers, Nakers <laughs> and sombrero. All right, how do I get out of here? Says so, uh, do. And unequip. Oh no! Put the put it back on. No wait. Which one was it? Sombrero. This is right. sombrero. Yeah. Accessories. Suit. Oh, okay, I did it. There we go. Now you look <laughs> like a pong champion in the making. He's perfect. Lead this young paddle to the training dungeon. Yes, your highness. <laughs> 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 boing 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 boing. All right. <laughs> All right, let's play some more Pong, I guess. Enter the training dungeon. Oh, it's Jesus. Time to train. Okay. Well, who are you? Are we going to have a Pokemon battle? Okay, you got to find treasures. Uh, so, okay. Ah! Oh, no. Mimic Anna attacks. Oh, no. Okay. I got to get my, get my elite Pong skills on. Mimic Anna has all these, like, special ball power-ups. Bouncy ball. Take her out. Okay. Well, can I? I mean, all right, I want to like get that power up, but I'm no good at. All right, there you go. Whoa. Well. Oh shit. Sweet win, bro. I got $150 for killing that pong. Uh, if an enemy paddle sees you, the challenge you to pong battle. Okay. New ball. Bouncy ball. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Alrighty. Uh, oh man. Look yeah. Alive. Money. 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 We even got. Uh, we got a potion ball. What does that do? It's a health. Come on, God! They made this thing into an actual RPG. Yeah. Oh my! My inventory is full. Uh, wait. Can I just like get the potion ball? How do I drop the previous? There we go. X. X. I want the potion ball. No! God damn it! Potion ball. What is this one? Squash ball. Hmm. Huh. Gives you uh, one turn field high wall. Okay, that's all right. All right. Go kick some balls. Come here, you. You clown or why? What? Dummy Sophie. Oh, okay. Like a crap. Oh, God damn it. Wow, Jeff. <laughs> I'm going to get my potion ball. That way I can uh, get my health back. Yeah. Squash ball time. What's up now? <laughs> Nice. This game is very weird. Yeah, this is not a normal game. <laughs> <laughs> it's advanced. Uh, what was your favorite old arcade game, Amanda? Oh, wait, is it like a monster or something? I think I was a Pong person. I'm trying to think of like what I really played. I was like a Pac-Man person. We used to go to a pizza place and they'd have that like sit down. You had to stare like directly down at the table. Uh, yeah. Pac-Man. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. cocktail cocktail table ones. Yeah. Uh, yeah, those are those are cool. I'm a big fan. Uh, uh, uh. 
Leech Ball. Whoa, shit. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'm bad at Leech Ball. Blah. Take that. Yeah, I stole your lives. Ha ha. Uh oh. Whoa, why did it give it back to you? Well, that sucked. Oh my god. Whoa, did he also use a Leech Ball? Oh shit, I'm gonna die. He's a potion. Urgh. This music is pretty rocking. I know. Uh, the music that they've played this whole time has been really good. Zip ball. Doom, 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 doom. Oh. Yeah, suck it. I got I got ripped up clothing, and I got to level two. Oh, nice. Extra inventory slot. What's a glue gigaw? An odd charm that makes enemies a little slower. I think we should do that. I think we should okay. get the gigaw. The glue gigaw? The gigaw. Yeah. All right, and I got a key, and I got a big key. Oh, so this is the freaking Legend of Zelda. I just realized, or Binding of Isaac, I guess, depending on your point of view. Uh, depending on how old you are. Yeah. Uh, drop that. Let's get whatever this is. The Balldozer. Okay. All right, I don't really know what, what all that was about. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, man, did I tell you I beat uh, Fatal Frame 2? Yeah, you uh, live streamed it, didn't you? Yes, I did. Uh, I was like thoroughly disappointed because uh, it turns out that I got the like the the medium ending, the shitty ending. I mean, in fairness, we spend a lot of time being lost and not knowing what to do. Yeah, except that I like you had to beat the game. You had to beat the game on hard in order to get the good ending. And I'm never I've never been a big fan of that. Um, oh no, it's it's Derek. <laughs> This is just making me want to go back and watch The Good Place all over again. Uh, eat this curveball, Derek. Whoa. Oh, shit. Derek's got some moves on him. Another curveball for you, Derek. Uh-oh. All right. How about a bouncy ball? Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Derek, don't give two shits. Yeah. Derek is just spitting in my face. Spitting in my pong face. Yeah. Oh, suck it, Derek. Eat it, Derek, you dumb... Ah, oh, shit. Oops. Oh, oops. Yeah. Oh, you're dying, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, I died again. <laughs> I did it wrong. <laughs> Stupid Pong. You were. Damn you, Derek. Oh, no, I did it again. I... <laughs> My brain refused to think about it. Game over. Oh, no. Aww. Oh, no. Oh, bye. Bye. I guess. Wait, do I have to start the training dungeon over? Wait, what? You just exited. <laughs> I just quit the game? Okay. Yeah, you're like, meh, I'm done here. Uh wait, but I didn't I didn't win. Do I have to do the whole dungeon? Oh no, I've got to do the whole dungeon over again. Son of a bitch. Uh, uh come on, just give me the stuff. Go to cash. Right. Um Wait, is everybody gone except for Derek? Wait, oh. No, there there's we go. a Nicola. Eat curveball, Nicola. <laughs> oh, crap. He was good at the curveball. <laughs> What's all that about? Uh, whoa. Yeah. yeah. Good job. I you did, did the thing. Oh, huzzah. Huzzah. So, Amanda, how's life in Animal Crossing treating you these days? Uh, Pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. You, I mean, uh, there's a bunch of new stuff that's coming out. Um, like the day after to, on the 23rd so f two days from now yeah i from saw that recording this yeah like earth day stuff and um i guess the whole month of june is like wedding season okay which is weird you you and john gonna have a uh, renew your vows in animal crossing yeah we're gonna get yeah we're gonna get married uh double married we're gonna get animal crossing married <laughs> oh man double marriage that's uh yeah yeah <laughs> It's a hell what, of a commitment. What happens when you get double married? Yeah, they take out the uh, till death do you part part. It's just <laughs> <laughs> you got to keep being married even if you're a zombie. You're like, oh shit, I didn't know what I was signing up for. Uh, I mean, yes. <laughs> ah, give me those. <laughs> what, uh, money. Who's that? I got the perfect puzzle for an intelligent paddle like you. Sure. In a, mo a few moments, lights will turn into sequence. Remember the sequence and stay on the lights the correct order. Oh, God. Damn it. This is my second least favorite 
the thing. I hate Simon. I have a horrible memory, Amanda. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, you got it. Good job. I did it. Huzzah. Yahoo's. Uh, what do you got? Wait, what would you say? Manage your balls before you get locked into a battle. Um, yeah, let's see. Uh, Simon puzzles. Uh, the Pong puzzles. I'm trying to think of which other ones I don't like very much. Uh, uh, oh, memory? I hate that one, too. I used to love like the memory matching games when I was a kid. Yeah. They would like, flip all the cards, and then all the cards would be flipped, and you have to figure it out. Uh, yeah, those are the ones that I hate. Uh, but I do like Guess Who. That was a good game. That was a fun game. I like that board. That like, there's nothing more fun than asking one question than being like, clack, 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 <laughs> pulling down like all the people it can't be. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Eat it, uh, whoever you are. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm going to need to get my health back before I go to the boss. Ooh, ha, ha. Ugh. Ugh. I'm gonna just pretend like it takes a lot of work. Ugh. Ugh. I'm gonna pretend like I'm one of those people that plays like ping pong and they like lunge across the table and shit. <laughs> uh, right. I did it! Hooray! Good job! You found the boss key, but I got like jack shit worth of anything. I'm like almost dead. All right, I'm just gonna have to use up yeah, all you are. potions on Derek. Oh shit! It's a store! How much money do I have? Buy this blue headband. All right, that's it. That's all I want. That's all I want. All right. All right. Let's get the potions Potion. out. Whoa, damn it. <laughs> potions. I got to use them all. Oh, Derek. <laughs> oh, no. Derek, you son of a bitch. Oh, I got the potion. One potion. Get more potions. More po oh, good. All right. Oh, Derek, you, you piece of garbage. I hate you so much. All right, there you go. <laughs> Why is this one so hard for you? I don't know. It's because I hate Pong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Blow me, Derek. <laughs> um, what is... I keep using this Mimic Ball, and it doesn't seem like it does anything. Huh? I have to, like, activate it? No? Okay. What about uh, Mimic Ball? No? Yes. Oh, ooh. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, you eat oh. it, Derek. Yeah, son <laughs> of a bitch. Got you. Oh. Oh, I got the boo barber. That's pretty cool. Nice. All right. Head on back to the castle. <sighs> you know, I I wonder, Amanda. Is, Do you? Is, uh, Final Fantasy VII, Persona 5. You know, we got a lot of games coming out. I don't really understand what would convince uh somebody to make this this pong thing um did you have an atari 2600 when you were a kid no no we started with the nes uh, okay so you never got the joy of uh of playing like super super low rent versions of arcade games that were no. pac-man how do i get out of this dungeon i thought there was a like a portal in the room with but Derek? you just changed yeah you just walked out of it oh okay did i do it wrong oh geez yep yep Yep. I was like, oh, he must be going to collect stuff. Okay. Uh-huh. I need to be fit as a fiddle. I mean, exciting adventure. This castle used to be a glorious, sprawling paradise, but now the castle's lost. My subjects have all been driven mad. Me too, King Pong. <laughs> Turned against me, and it's all because of the spooky door. No, oh, the spooky door. Wait, that's the name of the Twilight Zone. Oh, that's a scary door on Futurama. <laughs> um, Turns out it was man. Yep. At least I think it has. Anyway, there's something weird and creepy about it. Don't you think? I don't. My Our guy doesn't seem to think it's it's all that spooky. All right. Can't get inside. He's got a real judgmental face. Look at those eyes. <laughs> it's given the, given the king one of those uh, incredulous emojis. Uh, all right. So we got to go get the four orbs. <laughs> all right. Yes. The breakdown <laughs> penitentiary. Oh, man. This is like where he puts political prisoners and stuff. All right. Let's go for it. Nice. 
rats and things. Okay. Wee! Yay! Oh no, it's a princess. What's up, princess? I'm a princess, and I can't be expected to wait through all these monsters. Maybe if someone cleared them all out, I can find my way to the exit. <laughs> okay. Well, are you just gonna stand there? Yes, I am. Who's this guy? Prison out of these nifty, colorful bricks. Okay. Yeah. Good. What's uh, that triangle? It's a tri-ball. 75% the side and 75% the predictability. So it's a pong ball except it's a triangle instead of a regular one. Here, I, these zipper balls suck. We'll take the tri-balls. Yeah. Yeah. It's my favorite YouTuber. Tri-balls. <laughs> uh, oh, no. A prisoner. It's Liam. Oh, Bandit Liam. Liam, you're going to get this tri-ball. Check this out. Triangles. Uh-oh. What, what did he just do? Oh. I don't know. Uh, uh, oh, oh God damn it. Boo! Yeah, I agree. Oh, he made it to try ball. Or no, he made it to buff ball. Ow. Uh. Oh no. Oh no. Tired of your sarcasm, Jeff. <laughs> I don't have anything else today. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a Pong game. <laughs> vampire what? bat. Batman? Are you fighting Batman? No, it's a vampire bat. Teresa, the I... vampire bat. Well, it looks like Batman. I'm going to get my health back. Yeah, potion balls. Yeah, more potions. Plunder ball. I don't know what that does. What? Why did it heal them? Because they're a vampire. Why would you do that? Uh, uh. At least it wasn't. Uh, uh, what is that? Oh, we got cat ears. Wes Craven's vampires dollar sign. Oh, God. Uh, sure. Give me more hit points. Why not? To uh, squander. All right. Let's see what's going on over here. Let's go down this big room. Who? Oh, there shit. we go. Eleanor. Okay. Got all kinds of uh, Good Place references in here. Did you watch The Good Place, Amanda? Nope. No? No. John watched, I think, the first and second season, but uh, I didn't... I wasn't in the room when that was happening. Mm. Ah! Crap! Okay, give me that leech ball. Uh, there we go. Nice. There we go. Good job. Yep, that's so, me. Proud of you. Full... <laughs> <laughs> Don't you lie to the audience like that. <laughs> they know you're not proud of me, and I know you're not proud of me. I've done nothing. Swag bag Matilda. Why would they throw a swag bag in jail? You just take the swag out of it. I mean, you know. I hope we get the bag costume. Uh. <laughs> hey, all right. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Matilda? Oh, boy. Okay, here we go. Yeah, so usually, you know, this is the part of the dojo when, uh, uh, you know, the game is, is kind of boring and we talk about other stuff. But mm -hmm. I, haven't, I haven't done anything, Amanda. I've just been sitting sitting in my house doing doing pretty much this. Uh, we've been watching movies every day for the last five days, four days. Anything good? Uh, we watched Hail Caesar by the Coens. Oh, yeah. Um, I thought that was... Okay. It was okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we watched The Pirate, which is an old 1948 uh, Judy Garland, Gene Kelly movie. Yeah. We watched uh, On a Clear Day, You Can See Forever, starring um, Barbara Streisand. Okay. What's that about? And then uh, it's about a young 22 uh, year old girl who has ESP who. Um, gets hypnotized by a professor and uh -huh. she uh, he finds out that she like remembers past lives oh god damn it yeah and and, so, and then so it's like a dual story about her and then her past one of her past lives oh like Outlander uh, yes sure it's Outlander <laughs> um, but it's a musical and it's cute and um yeah, it's like very, very. It's like it came out in 1970, and it's like Technicolor. Her all her outfits are amazing. She goes to sleep in full makeup. It's like <laughs> it's a very old movie. That sounds pretty cool. And then we watched um, Dune. I saw Dune for the first time. Oh, the David Lynch. Well, which one? David Lynch one or the sci-fi one? 
The David Lynch one. Oh, uh, David Lynch one is a bit of a trip. Yeah. Uh, we were, yeah, it was the extended cut, so I guess it was the more so David oh, Lynch. Shit. Uh, well, it depends on which one, right? Because there's like, uh, there's actually like eight different versions of that movie. There's one that's like, there is an extended cut, but then there's also like, the studio put together like a three-hour cut with a bunch of garbage in it, and it's an Alan Smithy because, uh, yeah, Lynch f- refused to put his name on it. Not that one. Yeah, take it. Uh, no, I don't believe it was that one, but it was definitely long. It was definitely an extended cut. Yeah, you um, see, uh, Sean Connery. But it was good. It was. <laughs> ah, damn it. But yeah, yeah uh, I really enjoyed it. Uh, and then we watched Evil Dead One and Two. Mm. Um, yeah, I saw those uh, those uh, 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 production photos from the new Dune. Um, I have. Uh, let me ask you this. Uh, what I mean, like, you said that you enjoyed it. Um, mm-hmm. What what you know, your your overall thoughts on Dune were like, was it was it coherent? Was it like? Did you understand the story and everything? Did you feel like you were missing parts of it? or uh... I don't know if coherent is how I would describe it, but okay. it was definitely, it just came off like a political drama mm-hmm. uh, kind of or like a religious political drama because it was very like the prophecy, the prophecy kind of thing. Right. Um, but, and then it would kind of just gloss over stuff and you just had to... Um, go with the flow where it was just like time has passed just keep going mm-hmm. <laughs> um but i mean overall it was really interesting i i don't know how they would expect to fill that much information in a movie nowadays like it, three hours isn't enough for it it yeah. didn't feel like this is a movie that definitely felt like it should be more than one movie yeah no i agree uh the problem i was like my huge problem with dune is uh oh man the cops what jenny i'm the king sent me here jenny god damn it uh jenny i got your number is that um the uh oh my god jenny put down bring, put, bring the walls down jenny um <laughs> uh is that uh so much of that book in fact so much of all five of those books is inside of characters heads so yeah. it's um it's one of those things where I don't know how you make a movie about it because we're not like, oh, this person is sad and we could just change it so that they say, I'm sad. It's like, no, this person is having some kind of like internal struggle. Like the whole idea of the Kwisatz Haderach and the genetic memories of the, the Bene Gesserit and like what that means mm-hmm. and what Paul's drinking, what, you know, what the, 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 the spice is, what it does. Like so much of that is inside of people's heads in the books and I just have no idea how you're supposed I mean, to I, convey that you just give everyone inner dialogue like they do in in the lynch movie the lynch movie um but it's also very funny because they whisper their thoughts oh yeah which i thought to me was really funny because you don't whisper it's all happening monologue? inside their head and they're just like just like what i dreamed about <laughs> like all super secret whispery yeah yeah so your inner monologue doesn't it doesn't whisper it's not a whisper. No, I sh- yeah, it's a lot of shouting. It's a lot of horrible, horrible shouts. Ah! <laughs> it's like the scene in the movie where they cut to Amanda. And it's like everybody's doing their internal monologue, and it's like, oh, I wonder what's for lunch today. Man, I can't believe that we've the whole year is almost passed. And then the camera pans over to Amanda, just ah! Yeah, that sounds about right. Ooh, polka dots. Ooh, ghost balls. Sure. Uh, yeah, to drop do, this, do, no, do, drop do. this, grab this. Um, <coughs> yeah, I don't know. I, uh, I've, I've come to the conclusion that I don't like, there's a couple of books that I think, and like properties and stuff that when I was young, I feel like I really wanted them to be like, I really hope they make an Akira live action movie someday. And now I'm like, boy, I hope they never make an Akira live action movie. There's no way that should be a live action movie and it's fine as an anime. That's why I'm a really really nervous about that Cowboy Bebop Netflix show that they're making because... Yeah, but I mean, whatever. It doesn't take away from the stuff you've already seen. That's true. That's true. I guess it's just... Um, the main the main issue that I have with Dune is that I want them to get to the really weird stuff. I mean, do you know what happens like in the, the fourth Dune book? Um, I know that Duncan Idaho gets cloned. I know that... 
Uh, also, Duncan Idaho is the basic of shit name. And there's something kind of hilarious about John like, Potato. It's, it's just very funny to me that the, it's like, ooh, this intergalactic political uh, religious world and um, the spice and these creatures and you know, evolved man. Anyway, this is Paul and his best friend Duncan. <laughs> um, it's and just Derek. you know what I mean, like, and his mom Jessica, and it's yeah. just like, what? Wait, hang on. Yeah. No one could come up with a good name. I mean, everybody else has a good name. Right, the Baron Harkonnen and fucking uh, uh, the, the Emperor, uh, the Padishah Emperor. Uh, yeah, but like the main character is fucking yeah. Paul. They all come and from his planet, best friend uh, is Duncan. They come from planet White Guy. I mean, Gurney Halleck. Duncan, goddamn Idaho. Yeah. Uh, all right, what you got? Give it to me, please, man. Yeah, what's up now? Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, in the so in the later books. Um, uh, this it can't be a spoiler, right? These books have been out since like the fucking early '80s, like late '70s. Like this yeah. is not exactly the first time. Also, Are you talk about like Paul d- creating like a following of people to go against himself. No, no, not that. Oh, the vortex. Uh oh. Um, oh, now it's just breakout. Oh, what's happening here? It turned into breakout. Uh, I've got a minute to play breakout. Um, you got a minute to win it. Uh, no, like in the fourth book is uh, is when uh, one of the main characters turns into a half man, half sandworm, and then rules the galaxy. And it sk- time skips forward like like twenty five hundred years or something like that, and things get really strange. Uh, and then from there, the you get the uh, the uh, honored matres who are basically Bene Gesserits that use like super good sex to control people's minds and like uh they become like drug addicts because the only way that they can get their fix is by having sex with these ladies and uh then they just like fuck everything up so uh dude gets weird oh no i lost you lost it took all my shit i didn't know that was gonna happen come here slimy oh joanne oh it is a slime bleep boop all right it looks like a creeper oh yeah it does uh, uh, you know, I would be fine with this game if it was like, um, like a mini game that was inside of a different game. <laughs> yeah. Like it's not. Agreed. It's, it's not a bad idea taking like Pong and giving it like uh, kind of like Arkanoid rules or whatever, giving it some like weird shit. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if I want to play a full game. Oh, hey princess! Oh, I got the princess hair and the yeah. ball dozer. All right. Well, you know what? Uh, we're pretty much out of time. Oh. 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 <laughs> We're really out of time. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you've gotten something out of this. Um, yeah. Uh, hit the like, subscribe button. Let us know what you think of this rat pong man in the comments. <laughs> uh, Patreon.com forward slash rage likes where you can go if you want to just hang out and be on our Discord server. Or maybe you want to, like, kick us some bucks and get a whole shitload of bonus videos bunch of sequentials michael and i just are playing the original bioshock and uh a game holds the fuck up so if you were wondering nice. you don't have to subscribe but i'll give you that one for free everybody um so yeah also uh amazon links we'll have amazon links i'll probably put an amazon link because i doubt this is on amazon i'll probably put an Am- amazon link to like a like so like one of those like atari 2600 joysticks you just plug into your tv and it, it's got 600 games on it or something yeah. um yeah, and so use that. Use it to buy whatever you want to. You don't have to use it to buy that 2600. You can use it to buy whatever you want to. And, uh, yeah, be sure to come back on Sunday. I've been streaming. I think I'm going to keep streaming this Sunday. There's a new XCOM nice. out on Friday, and I think if I can – oh, yeah, I can't name all the people after the crowd because it's not that kind of XCOM game anymore. So. Boo. Yeah, uh, but I am going to be playing it. So uh, I already got my whole week planned out. So come see me on Saturday – or Sunday. Sunday, not Saturday. Um Speaking of Saturday, a man and I are going to start playing Doom Eternal. Finally. Yeah. Yeah. Finally. Doom. Fatal Frame. We can get back to Doom. Um, so you should watch that, too. Amanda, is there anything that you want to throw out there today? Uh, No. Stay alive. Okay. Stay alive. Stay home. Be safe. Do your thing. And we'll see you tomorrow with another video. Bye. Bye.